just a few months ago, our family got together to celebrate Philip's first birthday. I chose the theme of picnic and planes with the message, Time Flies, and that's because time really flies when you're having fun. And can't you tell, I'm really having so much fun as Philip's mother. Because it's a milestone in his life, I was very hands-on with the details. Today on Handy Mom, I will be showing you how I made that photo bunting for Philip's photo corner. And then, there are also very easy DIY decorations that I will teach you that will surely add a personal, more thoughtful tone to your child's next party. Prepare your child's photos ahead of time. Hang them on a jute rope using wooden clothes pins. You can also add artworks to alternate with the photos. So when you put it on your wall, you can fix it some more or add more details like I used washi tapes to make to serve as frames for my photos. All right? Cut two donut-shaped um, figures. Place both circles together. Thread your yarn onto a needle. Wrap it through the center until you cover the circle with yarn. The more yarn you use, the fuller your pom-pom will be. Next, carefully cut the yarn around the edge. The blade of your scissors should go between the two pieces of cardboard. Now slip a piece of yarn in between the cardboards to tie the pom-pom. Pull tightly, then tie. Remove the cardboards, trim edges to make pom-pom rounder. For Philip's picnic and planes party, I actually just put like welcome baskets on each and every mat to serve as like the container for all of the guests' utensils. Place all your paper plates, cups, and other utensils inside the welcome basket. Now for every welcome basket, I also had a, a welcome frame. So what's that? Just get an, any existing frame from your house and then replace the background with a dark colored paper and you can just choose to write something that is related to your theme so like ours is like picnic and planes so I put welcome aboard Kramers I'm welcoming you Cheska with the whole gang <laughs> the whole family choose to add a hashtag if you have one for your baby's party for this, let's choose Mommy Hacks. You may also tie your ribbon on one side of the basket and a bunch of balloons on the other. Ta-da! Here's my welcome basket! Combine all these, and just like Philip's party, everyone will remember how much creativity and love you've put into your child's special day. Anyway, we want to know about your party ideas as well. I'm pretty sure you have your own thoughts, which you can post on facebook.com slash mommyhackstv. And we'll be right back. Later on, Cheska and mom Tricel de Guzman are blending a sweet meal ender for kids. 